Hello everyone, welcome to my APG Studio channel. How to do a tree pose today? Special video, very easy, simple way how to improve your tree pose in terms of balance and strength, core and stability. Okay, so let's get started. First, balance. How to practice to make your position stronger to hold this position in good balance and good stability. That's the secret, just here. Like a belt around your hips, your core muscles. When you're doing any balancing pose, not only tree pose, but any balancing pose, you need to really focus on this area. Strong abs, you need to pull them in, contract, and also your glutes. So you have to squeeze the glutes as much as you can, control the muscles, and that's right now when you do that, you get to feel, I've got the strength in here, and this is center of the gravity. This is the secret for balance. Hold muscles strong and under control. And to practice, start first lifting heels off the floor. First, if you're both heels, legs together so you can make it easier just pressing your heels together okay both legs in pressing against each other so that's give you good stability so it's not separate legs it's like a one strong leg don't focus on your heels focus on this part of your body center of the gravity to lift your hips and slow it down so first that's what you should practice and now balancing on your one leg this is again really important you've got your glutes muscles on your leg on the floor engage when you turn your leg to your side to your left right now you're not putting your hip to your right strong glutes before you start and now without changing position alignment your right hip you're moving your leg just in the moment you feel the stretch in your left leg, your inner thigh. No more. You hold. If you feel, yeah, okay, I'm fine with this, but I'm not going to lift my leg. That's fine. That's position to start. If you're really bad with balancing poses, this is the way to start. Be patient, practice every day. If it's your desire to be better with balancing on one leg, but it's no shortcut. No way. This is the simplest way to do that. Instead of struggling to lift your leg high, you're holding position and muscles engage in the right place. And eventually, you're trying to lift your leg higher. So this is strength in your core and your leg. But also, you need flexibility in your inner thighs. How to do that? If you lay down on your back, Let's say if your right leg straight, bring your knee left close to you, and our foot is touching your right leg. And you're just slowly moving your leg out down to the floor, again, squeezing glutes, holding lower back flat on the floor. Maybe yeah, the muscle is really tight, so you can't bring your leg that close. You're going to start close to your ankle or maybe knee area laying down on the floor so there's no pressure on your knee you can easily place your left foot against your right in your knee joint this is the way to improve the flexibility and bring the mobility in your hips so you need two factors to improve your tree pose balance which is your core strength and how high you're going to lift your leg is flexibility in your muscles in your leg and mobility in your hip joints. Okay, that's it. Simple as that. You know, it's gonna be easy options, easy way to practice and get better with your yoga or fitness. With my advice, very soon you're gonna be exercise like a pro. Thank you for watching. I'm looking forward to see videos or pictures before you start to use this technique right now let's do it send me and after some time 
when you're going to feel you've got more strength, more flexibility. Thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe for more videos and see you soon. Bye, guys.